resume our fight, huh? Miss Eye of the Wicked Lord. Apparently, Shichimia, in her Chinibio way, decided that Rika is a fallen angel, then deduced from her uniform which school she goes to, and came to see her. I never knew she had taken a turn for the worse. Don't push your luck, lady. I'll take you out next time. Zip it. No! Sorry, but I have to go home early. Huh? Yeah, I know, but Nana asked me if I'd walk Shichimia home today. Ah! What a fortuitous development. Let's raise a glass in honor of uh, our reunion. Oh. Too close? Yes, but only with juice, okay? Uh. Bye. You really haven't changed a bit, have you, Shichimia? <laughs> Settle down. Ow! Hey, why are you just hitting me? Rika, go put your bag away. Shichimia's folks are going to be home late from work, so she'll be eating dinner with us tonight. Huh? All right, Rika. Oh. If there's a problem, we can just battle for the title of Superior Magical Girl, you know. Just knock it off. Ow! You're such a forceful hero. Stop saying that stuff. <laughs> Rika used to live in the apartment above us, but due to unforeseen circumstances, she kind of found herself homeless. Wow! So you're a wanderer without a base in the mundane world? That's awesome! <clears throat> no, all dark beings behave in this way. And I'll have you know, I frequently spend time in non-existence while in this world. In fact, I only took up residence here due to my standing contract with Utah. It is merely a transitionary stage. That's a creative description of a freeloader. There's a contract? A contract through the eye of the Wicked Lord. The two of us have been bound together by fate for many moons. Really? Well, it's not really a contract. These two are going out. Huh? Who's a huh? It, it's a divine contract with the gods. It, it is not as commonplace as merely going out. Uh, I'm not so sure that's <gasps> helping things. Hero, that's uh, wonderful. Uh, that's so close. Not only did you find a new partner, but she happens to be the eye of the wicked lord, too. Uh, I got it. I get it. So back uh, off. So uh, tell me, what do you want? What exactly are the two of you searching for? What is your mission? My original goal was ultimately to discover the invisible boundary line. Newton and I have already achieved that objective with our combined strength. Therefore, my current objective is to awaken the Dark Flame Dragon sleeping within him. Dark Flame Dragon? I don't recall needing any such thing. Well, you do. Your spirit soul demands it. So there. Really? Dark Flame Dragon, huh? I see. Uh. I wish the best of luck to you, Eye of the Wicked Lord. Well, Hero, I'd better go home now. Huh? Already? Yeah, Sophia needs some time to prepare herself for the battle with the angel. What are you talking about? Hero. Uh-uh. Ah! Uh, uh. ah! <laughs> hey, Shichimia! She always had that habit. It's nothing, really. I mean, it's like a sort of greeting to her. The nose? Yes, the nose. The nose? Mm. All right. The two of us will enter into a contract. I promise that I will never go near any girl but you. You mean it? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> uh. And so... Safe in my anxious certainty that new trouble had yet to come, I was filled with careless joy. I was one step closer to Rika. We're gonna beat the high score! <laughs> go! Go! <laughs> For I am the sparkling monochrome monster! The star
here of all places, you know. Wait, just a second. Nibutani. You switched sides! No, I didn't! Listen, this data was secretly transferred between two hormonal teenage boys, remember? And based on Tagashi's terrified reaction to the thought of us getting a hold of it... What if those files contain something... Uh, what? No, no way! No way what? Uh, nothing. It's just... No, Dekamori. You have to elaborate. I, no fair! You're the one who brought it up! Dekamori? How do I explain? For one thing, it contains examples of Homo sapiens. Well, it's the female Homo sapiens, and it's primitive. Primitive? Come on, you guys. What? What does that even mean? I don't know! You're the one who put me on the spot! You could have done what better happened? than that! Why are you blushing? I'm not blushing, you're blushing! This is a school! Something like that doesn't belong in here! <laughs> Togashi! You're shameful, Galzonianzis! You have the wrong idea! I swear! Please let me go! Uh, you're wasting time! <gasps> Rico! I'm begging you. These ropes are starting to hurt. Boobies? <laughs> no, Master, it is unclean! And not appropriate for school! A swimsuit? That's it? That dirty little filthy pervert! Yuta! <sighs> Although there's no way he would have ever admitted it to me. <laughs> the Dark Flame Master is incapable of entertaining commoners' thoughts of trivial romance. No. I conquered that weakness long ago. So, what's it to you anyway? Uh... The Dark Flame Philanderer. It wasn't that bad. He just liked to look at girly pictures once in a while. I mean, Hero is a boy, you know. I'm sure he probably still has a few dirty magazines hidden in his room. That's a different issue. Whoever this woman is, she obviously had a grip on Yuta's heart well before we entered our contract. That's different? Different! But why? His contract is with the Eye of the Wicked Lord, not some magazine bimbo. And yet, there's still a voice inside me saying, No! And why? And ah! Wow, I had no idea you were so possessive. Huh? Do you think so? Hmm, who knows? Maybe that's a good thing. A good thing? Utah. Rika, I only have eyes for you. Yuta. <laughs> oh yes, and you as well. I also have eyes uh, for you, baby. Yuta! <laughs> it isn't nonsense at all! The Eye of the Wicked Yeah, Lord! yeah, I know, I know. This whole thing is Tagashi's fault. Don't worry, Takanashi, I'm definitely on your side. Why are you siding with her? Well, this all started with you betraying her trust! You said you'd give it back and then took it with you! But that's not the issue. Oh, yes it is. None of this would have ever happened if you had just kept your stupid promise in the first place. I kept my promise. I took it to Ishiki like you said. And then I took it back home. I can't believe how disgusting you are! Deal with it. <gasps> Disgraceful! <laughs> For the last time, I'm not gonna play along. He's untouchable! He predicted our every move. Of course I did. Don't you realize how many times I've battled you two ding-dongs? Then why do you refuse to attack us? I was under the impression that you would finally awaken to your true power as Gelzonianzis! This doesn't concern you! Rika, I'm not gonna forgive you for this until you admit you were wrong. In fact, I'm starting to change my mind about going easy on you all the time. What? How dare you speak so harshly to my master? Hmm. Good thing I had this. Ah! <sighs> Let's go. You indirectly kissed her! This isn't the time for that, Rika! I knew it. They betrayed us. Not come back for a while. Uh. What's the matter? You indirectly kissed Dekamori. That's what you're hung up on?